oil. Now, the spill's impact on wildlife will be felt for years, even decades. Just a few hours ago, the Phoenix Zoo, though, took in six pelicans from the Gulf. Only on ABC 15, Christina Boomer travels with a lucky group of survivors just getting settled in. We're at the FedEx terminal at Phoenix Sky Harbor Airport. We're going to meet our uh, latest arrivals to the Phoenix Zoo. Here they are. See the crates? Yeah, these pelicans were collected in the Gulf of Mexico as part of the Association of Zoos and Aquariums working with all the rescue efforts down in the Gulf to try to place these animals that can't be released. When they were looking for oil birds, they came upon these birds, and these birds could not fly due to previous wing injuries. They can't get out of the slick, yeah. I'm really excited that uh, we can participate. It's kind of a, a way for Phoenix to participate in helping out in the Gulf there. Even FedEx employees were excited about the arrival of six American white pelicans. This one was quickly dubbed Snappy. I'm sure you can understand why. They're beautiful. They're, they're our new babies. Okay. Ready? Yeah. Go ahead. Put them in. Just take a look and make sure that nothing happened to them during the transport, that they don't seem too stressed out, and that they're uh, relaxed and we'll let them settle down into their surroundings. And then after a few days when they're calm, uh, we'll do an, uh, an examination on them. What we want to do is get these guys out of the sun as fast as we can, and then we can decide if we need to weigh them or not. This is the quarantine area where the pelicans will be for 30 days. They look real good. They look like they're a little bit warm, but uh, that's natural because we are in Phoenix. And after we get them unloaded, they'll have a fan and a pool to cool off in. At this point, the pelicans get to stretch their wings. And for all his energy, Snappy was the last one out of the crate. And there he goes. Well, by bringing them here, uh, we're really uh, trying to make a difference for uh, a handful of animals. You can check them out for yourself in about a month. Christina Boomer, ABC 15 News.